Hello YouTube, this is Roscoe 2 and today I thought I would make a video for you about one of my favorite monthly Melotechnic magazines, which is called Western and Eastern Treasures, as you can see. It's been around since the mid-1960s, um, and it focuses only on Melotechnic. Now, by that I mean that it focuses on, th on treasure hunting that involves a metal detector. Um, it doesn't really focus on um, th um, gem collecting or anything like that. The magazine, depending on which season slash month it is, it will focus on uh, about three or four different things. Um, them being coin shooting, relic hunting, beach hunting, and then they'll have, um, I believe in April, they have a yearly best finds of the year magazine. That not only does the magazine cover those four topics, but it also discusses and has articles on how to use your metal detector as well as techniques. MD reviews that appear on occasion as you can see in this magazine or this edition of the magazine you can see right there it says testing two new coil tech all train x terra coils so sometimes it'll do um, accessories other times it'll do the whole metal detector um, the, the, the reviews they come in um, sometimes four or five times a year sometimes two or three times a year it really just depends on how they want to do it Western Eastern Treasures like most other magazines makes most of its money not from subscribers but from putting ads in it you can see right here this is a whites ad you can see it takes up the first two pages of this magazine um, it's always there the metal detecting communities um, buy the same spots in the magazine every month um, they do they do change every few months to a different ad but you can see there are um, ads you can see this is the XP Dewis you can see on the back of the magazine Garrett always has the back page of it now these ads although I'm showing you where they appear you can see this is a CXT 3030 no CTX 3030 my bad it takes up two pages but you can also see there's a fair amount of pages that don't have as many ads now they usually the pages will have a small ad in the corner if they're not an ad page to begin with. This isn't an ad, that's just information about the magazine. Another important point is that most articles, including the ask about the find section, which is also in this magazine, they have they have pictures of the finds. You can see right there. Um but um as for regular articles and they have you can see this is the club news section they have pictures of the hunters that were involved in an event they have uh, pictures of where people are hunting what they're finding you can see right there so the magazine does have a fair share of pictures now overall i like this magazine i've been me and my dad have been subscribing to it probably for the last two five six years it doesn't necessarily teach you every month about melotechnic but it does show you finds of and how the signal might have come in on a certain machine depending on how deep the author wants to get into that so if you're interested in it remember it does coin shooting relic hunting beach hunting and then it has the yearly best finds issue